In this video, I am going to show you how to connect WhatsApp with N8N and create a simple chatbot just to show that both are connected and fully functional. Let's start with a WhatsApp trigger. Click on Add, search for WhatsApp, and you will see multiple actions and triggers in there. You can choose any trigger as per your agent requirement. In this case, I am choosing On Messages. Open the trigger and click on Create New Credential. As you can see, it requires client ID and client secret, which we have to get and paste here. Now the question arises, where do we get these IDs? Simple. Click on the Open Docs link here on top. It will redirect you to this tab in which there is a complete document. Under Requirements, you can see a link to Meta Developer. If you have a Facebook business account, you automatically have a Meta Developer account as well. For the WhatsApp trigger, we need OAuth keys. And for WhatsApp Cloud, API keys work. Click on Meta Developer. Under Step 1, click on the developers.facebook link, and it will take you to the Meta Social page where you create and connect all the apps. Click on My Apps, top right. Then create an app. Here it will ask for the app name. We will say YouTube, or a name of your own choice. App contact email will be your Facebook email by default, but you can change it if you want. Now you have to add use cases. Scroll down and click on Other, click Next, and select an app type here. You have to choose Business from here. That's it. Business portfolio is optional, so we will leave it as it is. Hit Create App. Once the app is created, you will see an interface something like this. Click on Set up WhatsApp to integrate WhatsApp. Select a business portfolio for WhatsApp business and click on Continue. With this integration, you will get five free recipient numbers to connect with, and after that, there will be a certain amount. Now this is the dashboard we need, where we can get whatever we need to connect our WhatsApp with N8N. Now for the WhatsApp trigger, we required client ID and client secret. On the left sidebar, click on App Settings, and then hit Basic. Here you will see App ID and App Secret, which are Client ID and Client Secret respectively. Copy both keys and paste into N8N. Moving on to the WhatsApp Action, or WhatsApp Cloud. Hit Add and select Send Message Node. Click on Create New Credential. Now here it will ask for Access Token and Business Account ID. Go back to your Meta app which we just created. Click on WhatsApp, and then API Setup. Now hit Generate Token. Facebook will ask for permission, continue and then click on Opt-in to all current and future WhatsApp accounts, and hit Save. Copy your API key and paste into N8 in here. Now for the business ID. Below the test number you will find your WhatsApp business account ID. Copy this ID and paste into N8 in and hit save. So for the test number, you can either use Meta's test number or connect your own business WhatsApp number. And for the recipient number, add a number where you want to send a message. All right, now that we have connected N8N with WhatsApp, let's test it by creating a simple bot that will reply to anything you ask. For example, if you ask what is the capital of Canada, it will answer Ottawa. Or whatever question you have in mind, it will answer. For that purpose, we will add an OpenAI node where you will have to connect your OpenAI account and choose the message a model operation. For bots, GPT-40 or GPT-3.5. Turbo works really well. So I will choose GPT-3.5 Turbo. Add a user prompt, which is going to be the text it received from WhatsApp using the WhatsApp trigger. Then you have to set a system prompt as well which says you are a helpful and friendly WhatsApp assistant. Answer messages clearly, concisely, and in a natural conversational tone. Avoid long explanations unless asked. Keep replies short and focused. Turn on simple output. Hit save, and now let's try our simple WhatsApp AI. We'll ask, let's say, where is Brazil located? And here you go. It gives an exact answer in seconds. If you loved this tutorial, 
Don't forget to like the video and subscribe. And if you want the ready to import workflow, join my free Facebook community where I share all the templates.